Yo, what it do, what it do, man. It's your boy Sneed back at it again with another report. Coming to y'all. So the Lakers are working out Tristan Thompson and Tony Bradley this week for the 15 man roster spot. I think that's very big for the Lakers. Um <clears throat> because you know they don't have a backup center. After AD go down, as far as winning Gabriel, and he's really not too, not much a center to me. I think he's more of a small forward, power forward type guy, um, as far as body wise. But as far as a center, I don't think he's a center to me. But just in my humble opinion, um, these guys, Tristan Thompson and Tony Bradley. Tony Bradley was waived by the Bulls a month ago. And from my understanding, I think he did sign with the Thunder and they waived him. Um, Tristan Thompson haven't played in a year. Last team he played with was the Chicago Bulls. Um, I wouldn't mind having Tristan Thompson back because he have, you know, chemistry in the past with LeBron James. Back in 2016, when they did win the championship for Cleveland, he's a hell of a rebounder. You know, he can play defense. He can guard the fours and the fives. You know, especially rebounding on the offensive end, that's very big for the Lakers um, because <clears throat> playing against a big team is very, very key, and that hurt the Lakers. This season, in some games, because we didn't have a big interior as far as, you know, uh, big bodies down low that can rebound the ball, block shots, and things like that. Um, and they're very thin. Like I said, really no center since Mobamba went down. And it doesn't look like he will come back for the rest of the season. So now the Lakers are shopping for another backup center. Now, they're not asking for them to come in and give them 30 or 40 minutes, 25 minutes. They're asking them to come in and just give a breather to AD um, to still be able to rebound, play some defense, and alter shots coming inside that paint while AD take a breather. Um, also, this is going to help AD at times, not have to bang with the big guys as far as Jokic and B. That's if Darvin Ham play both of the guys together. Um, Some may think he won't. I don't think he won't, but I hope he will. I hope I'm wrong. He does have a tendency to continue to play AD at the five, knowing he doesn't like to play the five. And that's been my biggest gripe with Darvin Ham. I really wish he would play AD with another big and put AD back in that power forward role. That way that's less less taxing on his body and he can continue to battle power forwards instead of centers and power forwards. So... In my opinion, I don't know much about Bradley. Um, I know he's, like I said, he can block shots, grab rebounds, but not to the capability of Tristan Thompson as far as rebounds. Tristan Thompson, when motivated to me, he is a beast on the board. At least I know he was back in 2016. Now, yes, that has been a while, um, and he hasn't played in what a year so you really don't know what Tristan Thompson has left to give you but again at least the Lakers are doing something going out and signing somebody because you know to the Laker fans the LeBron fans and just to people in general if they don't do something people are going to be disappointed and mad and said the Lakers should go out and do this and do that. If they do do something, you're still going to have people upset saying it's too late, 
should have been did this, he should have been did that. So, again, it's better late than never. They're trying to go out and sound somebody until LeBron come back to help out with the rebounding and things like that. And, you know, uh, getting the offense back up into speed. And the Lakers getting back on the road trying to make a push for the playoffs. So, me personally, I think this will be a good signing. Um, if it was me, like I said, I'm not, I don't know too much about Tony Bradley. Um, but as Tristan Thompson, yes, that's a person I would sign. And hopefully, like I said, he can give you a valuable minute when he's out there in defense, rebounding, block shot, you know. So, Y'all let me know what you think, man, in the comment section. With the Lakers adding Tristan Thompson or Tony Bradley. You know, let me know if you like either one of those guys or if you like the Lakers to go after someone else other than these two guys. You know? So, yeah, just leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, peace.